Hello Taurus and welcome back to my channel Lumen Moon Tarot. So Taurus I hope you guys are having a great weekend. I'm just checking in on your energy seeing whatever spirit wants us to know. Okay just take what resonates leave the rest behind you guys know the drill and thank you Taurus for being awesome. Just thank you for being awesome. Okay <laughs> if no one thanked you for that yet today I'm doing it. Thank you Taurus you guys are awesome. Um, thank you for all the likes. Thank you to all of my subscribers and welcome to everybody new here. All right, so Divine, what messages do you have for my beautiful Taurus? You guys know I love you, right? I always talk about your strength. I always see Taurus as one of the strongest signs in the zodiac, you guys. I love your energy. You're strong. You're down to earth. I love you guys. All right, so Divine just wanted to say that messages for Taurus ooh Taurus ooh well Taurus somebody here is learning a lesson okay um, they're mad they're mad because they're finding out that you have new love or this if this hasn't happened yet this is coming up in the future in August okay but somebody here is finding out that you have new love and they are big mad. And Spirit is telling this person, sit down. Sit down and just learn your lesson. Um, the reason why Taurus is getting new love is because of all the things that this person has done in the past. They're, they don't want to face, they don't want to face themselves. They don't want to change. They don't want to admit that they were wrong. They're very stubborn. Um, I feel like this person tries to project everything on you, like everything is your fault, Taurus. This is an ex from your past. And spirit is like protecting a new beginning for you as well here. Um, yeah, because the cycle is over. The wheel of fortune is turning in your favor and there's nothing that this ex can do to stop it. Okay, you're about to get new love and other blessings as well. Usually when I see this wheel, to me it's like um it's kind of like a, a machine, okay? <coughs> Excuse me, like an apparatus. And when this wheel turns, all of these little doors open up. Okay, one of them is love. Um, so love is going to come into your life, whether this person likes it or not. You're going to be loved the right way, okay? Because this is a blessing from straight from the divine. So this is going to be someone who's right up your alley, okay? As I say that, I keep thinking maybe this is this could be a neighbor of yours or somebody that lives in your neighborhood. That just kind of came to mind the way I said it, but this new person is someone handpicked for you by the divine and i feel like it's not just love coming in it's abundance it's opportunities okay the wheel is turning in your favor and somebody from your past is big mad about it but you you get to move forward peacefully spirit is holding this person back they need to learn some lessons they can no longer throw blockages in your path i feel like that's what they were trying to do or trying to slow you down by maybe getting you all up in your head about them. Okay, this is somebody who could have betrayed you twice in the past. And I feel like you're just done with this person. Okay, you're just done being messed with Taurus. But I feel like with this boat, the Six of Swords, you're being divinely led. Okay, this boat is divinely led. And you're moving into a new cycle. Okay, a new future for yourself with no blockages in your past, in your, in your path. So this past person, there's literally nothing they can do to stop you. There's nothing they can do to stop new love from coming in for you. There's nothing they can do to stop these opportunities for you. And that's what this person wants to do. Look at where you're headed, straight into your happiness High Priestess energy here. Judgment call in your favor. The scales are being balanced out for you. Okay, Taurus. I love this reading for you because you know what? It's about time. Who agrees with me? It's about time that Taurus 
that you had your time in the sun. This is, it's about time that you get opportunities and blessings coming in, okay? I feel like it's been a long wait. You've had to go through a lot. You've been very patient. Look at all of the, the divine is in your reading here. The higher font, judgment, justice, and the wheel of fortune. That's the universe saying, we're going to balance everything out for you, Taurus, because we've seen what you've been through. You have stayed prayed up. You have done whatever spirit has wanted you to do. You've allowed the divine to guide you. Okay? So I feel like spirit is saying it's your time now for some happiness. It's your turn to get these blessings. It is your turn. It's your time. Okay? Taurus, finally, finally, some things start moving and shaking for you, okay? For real. Yeah, and this person from your past, they are big mad, I'm telling you. They may even be trying to rally people to go against you, um, fight with you, okay? They could be trying to fight, argue with you. You know what? There's nothing they can do to stop this. Does this person think that they're above the universe? Do they think that they're bigger than God? Um, because honestly, you've got all of the universe out here working in your favor. Like for real, the higher font, they're protecting you, teaching this person a lesson, judgment, justice, and the wheel of fortune. Yeah, boom. This person is powerless to do anything to stop your progress now, okay? Yeah, and you're innocent. I feel like all this person does is think about you, but in a negative way. It just feels like they're constantly trying to find new ways to trip you up or ruin your pro like slow your progress, ruin your blessings. Okay. Yep. And you've been nothing but strong. See, this is like I know this card stands for Leo, but I always feel a lot of Taurus in this card. Holding your head up high, no matter what, okay? No matter what people throw your way, um, no matter how much you've had to endure, you hold your head up high, Taurus. That's like a Taurus trait. At least I see it as a Taurus trait, okay? Um you've got your boundaries up, you've got really intense, strong boundaries, yet you're down to earth. Um, I feel like just keep your boundaries up against this person, okay? Because they are trying to send you spiritual attacks. So I feel like you are to stay prayed up, do some cleansings, right? Pray to the divine to um, rebuke and cancel any negative energy being sent in your direction in the name of Jesus Christ, okay? Um, seriously, ask for this every day. Spirit wants you to put this in their hands, okay? And I feel like when you ask, when you ask them to protect you, you're putting it in their hands. And then this person gets their karma. I feel like all of this bad juju that they're sending you, Taurus, is going to come right back to this person. They're already in chaos and turmoil in their life. Okay, because so far nothing's had any effect and they can't stop your blessings from coming in. Okay. You know, these people, and this is how they want you. They want you in a mental prison. They want you feeling trapped and stuck. They want you to be feeling like you're blocked. Um, <clears throat> they want other people to be talking about you, putting you down. Okay, but that's just what they want. I feel like this is what they're going to get. That's what they're going to get. All of those intentions and the energy that they're sending with those intentions, it's all going to be sent back to them. I, I really am feeling like you're heavily guarded. You're watched over by the divine. Spirit is giving you these blessings, and they're for you, and there's no one can take it from you. This person can't stop you either. I feel like they've slowed you down in the past, but now there's no more blockages in your way. And spirit is like, it's almost as if the divine has built a wall, 
okay? Spirit has built a wall up so that this person can't get to you. They can't affect you. And I feel like all the negative energy they're sending to you is going to come back to them and it's going to affect them the way they wanted to affect you. It's true, though. That energy that they're sending you, it's all negative energy and it's, it's out there. It's got to go somewhere. When you pray and you rebuke it and cancel it, it goes straight back to sender. And that's what's happening here. And now they're going to be all up in their head. They're going to be feeling stuck. Okay? Because they're getting the same energy back that they're sending you. Yeah, and I felt this. Um, this is this person in their ego. Okay? You could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Okay? Maybe another Aquarius. You could be dealing with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio as well. But I feel like their ego is about to be crushed. I feel like this person thinks they're larger than God. I feel like they think that they've got um, no rules that they have to live by or rules don't apply to them, right? The universal laws don't apply to this person. They, they, that's what they think. Their ego is so large. This is, to me, this is the most egotistical king in the whole entire deck. Okay, this person is insulting, they're rude, they're disrespectful, inconsiderate, toxic, egotistical, and they think they're larger than God. And for all of that, they're the ones who are going to be affected by their own bad energy, okay? You're going to remain unaffected. You get to move forward, okay, Taurus? Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, there you are, the beautiful Queen of Pentacles. You're having a new beginning. A new beginning's been placed in your hand, okay? And I feel like your abundance is going to go up as well. So you're going to be um, able to save more money here in this new cycle. Uh, you could actually get like a job promotion or a raise in this, um, within this month of August, okay? I feel like you, you're going to feel free from the attacks from this person in August. Some of you may actually do a home cleansing or an aura cleansing, okay? But this is a new beginning for you. You're, um, I feel like you're going to feel comforted in August. You're going to feel comfortable in August, especially when it comes to your money. I'm seeing a, either a pay raise or a lot more money coming in. Okay? Yeah, and this person, I'm telling you, what did I say? All of that bad energy that they're sending to you is coming straight back to them. Okay? This is going to affect their home. <clears throat> it's going to affect their life. They don't get to think that they're above universal law. They don't get to think that they're above God. This person thinks they're larger than God, and God is going to, um, God's unleashing their wrath. Basically, they're going to they're gonna get God's wrath for that, okay? And look, here comes this new love I was talking about. This is somebody new, a new friend for you, Taurus. Um, this is somebody that you're going to be meeting here in August, maybe um, the third week in August. Someone's going to be approaching you. Earth angel energy and this person from your past, they are going to be so big mad. I'm telling you, this is anger, jealousy, because there's nothing they can do to stop it. There's nothing they can do to stop it. And any bad intentions they have, it's going to happen to them. Yep. So Taurus, get ready. It is finally your turn. It's your turn to have this glow up. It's your turn to get loved the right way. It's your turn to be happy and get these blessings and be comfortable and stable. It's your turn. Okay? And those spiritual attacks, they're not going to affect you. Yeah, this person's going to have to walk away. There's nothing they can do to stop it from happening. 
okay? There's nothing, nothing they can do to stop it from happening. This person had the audacity to, to feel like they were bigger than God. God took away all of their power. This person's absolutely powerless. You know, they're not, I feel like they may be toxic, they may be the devil in disguise, but this person cannot harm you, touch you, reach you anymore. You're free. You're free, Taurus. Yeah, see, you were thinking, when is it going to end? When will this person just stop sending me bad energy? Maybe for a while it was affecting you, making you feel exhausted, fatigued, confused, depressed. Not anymore. Those days are over. Yep, here comes, look, I'm telling you, it's your turn. It's your turn to win, Taurus. You're getting love and abundance here. Okay, it's coming in, and it, it, this is your new life starting, a new phase in your life, okay? So, yes, Taurus, this is awesome for you, I gotta say. Love, love, love this reading for you, man. Yep, because, see, it's all about energy, right? You put out really good energy to other people. Um, you help other people. You haven't been putting out any anything negative. So that good energy you're putting out is, is going to be returned to you in blessings, okay? And the bad energy that they put out is being returned to them. All right? And the same way they wanted you to feel, now they're going to feel. And you, you get all of this. Love, money, success, and abundance. And a new life. Taurus, you are free. You are free. You can rest. Rest assured, right? Time for a nap. Rest assured. There's nothing this person can do to block these blessings. Okay? What's on the bottom of the deck? You are blessed. Boom. Something told me to pick it back up. <laughs> I'm glad I did. There's nothing this person can do to stop these blessings from coming in for you. It is your turn. Spirit has decided. Judgment in your favor. Get ready to receive these blessings, Taurus. Yes. And honestly, you have waited so long for your turn, and it's here. Anyway, Taurus, that's what I've got for this quick reading. I do hope this helps. I hope it resonates. Um, claim this manifestation as your own, you guys. It's one of the best readings out of all the Zodiac readings so far. Okay? Um, I love you, Taurus. And it, you, if you like this video, please hit that like button. Subscribe to my channel, you guys. Join this awesome soul tribe. And until next time, everyone, take care of you and peace out.